What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Hershey Addict and today we have a quick shocking breaking news video regarding Hershey Park. It's been a relatively quiet off season for Hershey Park up until yesterday because on their social media platforms Hershey Park posted a very interesting photo. Take a look at this. So looking at the photo now you see it's a picture of the Hershey Park entrance gate with a big wooden box on the middle that says first class and this post was captioned mark this shipment first class. Now let's dive a little bit deeper because there's a lot of little hidden easter eggs within this box. I think the first thing about this box that's probably going to catch your eye is the logo in the bottom right hand corner of the box. Now looking at this logo, this is clearly the logo of Intamin Amusement Rides, one of the most popular manufacturers in the world, the makers of roller coaster Hershey Park like Sky Rush, Storm Runner, Fahrenheit, that is certainly Intamin's logo. Then if we move to the upper left hand corner of the box, there's a series of three logos, one of two arrows, a wine glass, and then an umbrella. Then below that logo is a hashtag with a number that reads 27512. Now, at first glance, it might just seem like random numbers, but I'm convinced these numbers are the key to solving what this message possibly means. Now, given that it's February 11th and we're super late in the offseason, Hershey Park really opens its doors next month in March. It's super late in the offseason to announce a brand new attraction, so I think whatever this box deals with is something on a much smaller scale. And again, look at those numbers in the top left corner and tie it with the Intamin logo, my mind goes to one place and one place only. This has got to be about Sky Rush. Looking at the numbers, 200. That just happens to be the height of Sky Rush. 75. That happens to be the top speed of Sky Rush, 75 miles per hour. And then that 12, well, what year did Sky Rush open? That's right, 2012. So all signs are pointing to that this box deals with Sky Rush, but what could it possibly do with? Well, I think we all know the answer to that. I am convinced that Hershey Park is finally, after years, at over a decade of complaints, Hershey Park is finally updating the Sky Rush restraints. That's right, the days of Thigh Crush may be no more. Now, is this confirmed? No, this is purely just speculation. But looking at all the clues, given how late it is in the off season, it makes a lot of sense that this would be a restraint update to Sky Rush, which would be absolutely massive. What kind of restraints could these be? I'm not really sure. It could be something on the, on the lines of Velocicoaster, which I would really like. It wouldn't shock me if they went with the Intimidator 305 route. That wouldn't shock me either. Or perhaps it's a brand new style of restraint that's built specifically for Sky Rush. It all kind of depends on the safety regulations and what is going to be allowed to be used on the ride, what's not going to be allowed. If it was up to me, I would love to see some Velocicoaster style restraints on Sky Rush, some of the best restraints I've ever been on. Please make it happen, but regardless, just the fact that they're updating restraints at all is absolutely massive because that's pretty much the only major gripe with Sky Rush is how poor the restraints are. So if they fix that issue, I mean, Sky Rush can be officially loved by the masses. Now, of course, this could also potentially be a new flat ride or another small addition regarding Intamin, perhaps the teaser for the years ahead of a brand new roller coaster that might have similar sets to Sky Rush. Who knows? But I think that's all a bit too much of a stretch. I'm pretty sure this has something to do with Sky Rush, just given those numbers on the top left corner. I've been trying to decipher what those symbols could possibly mean. The only thing I could think of is the double arrow refers to Sky Rush's height. Then the umbrella with the rain maybe refers to the weather in the sky. I have no idea what those symbols actually mean. Perhaps that has to do with what the restraint will look like. Who knows? If you what, Let me know what you guys think. What those messages in the top left corner, the arrow, the wine glass, and the umbrella. Because I have no idea what those possibly mean. But regardless, I just want to make a quick video just talking about this. I want to hear what you guys have to say. Could this finally be new restraints for Sky Rush? I guess we'll find out in due time. But for now, that's going to do it for this quick video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. This channel is your number one place for all things Hershey Park. But with that, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I hope to see you soon from the Hershey Addict. Peace. What a wonderful world.